Hey everyone, welcome back to a brand new video and if you're new here, my name is Edward Smith and welcome to my YouTube channel. In today's video, you and I are going to be looking at the top 5 best MIDI keyboards that you can buy in 2020. The first MIDI keyboard that we're going to be looking at is the Native Instruments Complete Control S61 MK2. The Complete Control S61 MK2 is a smart MIDI keyboard controller that offers pre-mapped control of NI's complete instruments and any third-party plugins that support the MKA standard. In comparison to its predecessor, the Complete Control MK2 also adds two high-resolution color screens along with 17 additional function buttons. There's tighter door and machine integration too making it possible to mix, navigate and edit projects from the hardware. You can do so much more from the device itself, with better visual feedback and much deeper levels of integration front and center of its workflow. If you're already web to the complete software package, nothing will help you work with it as musically as Complete Control MK2. The next MIDI keyboard that we're going to be looking at is the Arteria Keylab MK249. Keylab is Arteria's flagship controller keyboard and the MK2 comes in a 49 and a 61 key version in black and white. The MK2's keyboard and pads are blasted by door controls and deep integration with Arteria's Bundle Analog Lab 3 software. Although similar in layout to the Keylab Essential, the MK2 is a very different unit with a higher price tag and a more upmarket feel. The aluminium case feels robust and the profile keybed is fantastic, delivering excellent sensitivity across the full range of velocities. The metal pigeon mod wheels are light and responsive. The Keylab MK2 not only delivers fine playability, but also tackles door control and synth editing aplomb. Throw in CV connection capabilities and standalone operation, and the price seems justified. The next MIDI keyboard that we're going to be looking at is the Nectar Impact Alex 88 Plus. Today's buyers of keyboard controllers are spoiled for choice, but if you're looking for a full piano size 88 node MIDI controller, said choices are more limited. One great option is Nectar's Impact Alex 88 Plus, which combines an 88 key semi weighted USB powered keyboard with extensive door control via 9 sliders, 9 buttons, 8 knobs, 8 pads, and transport controls. Despite the number of features, the Alex 88 Plus is reasonably compact and light enough to be portable. What's more, the keys feel good and the mechanical noise is quite low. The Alex 88 Plus won't suit everyone and some 88 key users will be after a full weighted hammer action, but at this price, it's a bargain and well worth testing. The next MIDI keyboard that we're going to be looking at is the Akai MPK Mini MK2. As far as MIDI keyboards go, the Akai MPK Mini MK2 is an oldie but a goodie still hanging in there at the top of the sale charts after 5 years, and for good reason. The Kai have pitched the MPK Mini MK2 perfectly between breadth of features, portability, build quality and affordability. Standout features include the 4-way joystick for pitch bend and modulation, the built-in appreciator and note repeat functions, generous provision of knobs and fantastic feeling MPC style pads. Equally at home as a small lightweight MIDI controller to slip into your laptop bag when on the move or for controlling software instruments and plugins in a studio setting, the MPK Mini MK2 wraps everything up in an affordable, practical package. And the final MIDI keyboard that we'll be looking at in this top 5 list is the Novation Launch Key Mini MK3. Developed primarily for Ableton users and newly updated, this pocket powerhouse is just brimming with features, many of which were missing from the previous version including finally pitch bend and modulation touch strips, a hardware mini out on a TRS jack, an incredibly flexible and versatile appreciator, a chord memory feature and a great deal sweetening software bundle. Of course, the Launch Key Mini MK3 isn't exclusive to Ableton as it plays perfectly nicely with other doors too, but if you're a live user, it undoubtedly represents the best solution at this price point. So that's the end of this top 5 video of the best MIDI keyboards that you can buy in 2020 and if you guys enjoyed this video please do give it a thumbs up and if you loved it subscribe down below and I will see you for another video next time.